Hi, I'm Don. And I'm Ron, and we are members of Antifa. But what you don't know is that we're also the founders of Not, Not Antifa, Antifa Window, window repair. repair. If you ever need window repair, I got a bit of a suspicion you will, so. We realized that by living this double life, we were able to create the demand for our own services. We organize and cause riots, which then cause damage that creates customers. Then we take our costumes off Clark Kent style and show up first on the scene to get the business. Some bad people out there, yes, so. Yeah. Stuff happens, stuff's going to happen. Capitalism by day, communism by night. Ooh, that's a nice. You know, we saw the media and corporations all benefiting from the protests, and we thought, you know, why not us? Break us off some of those protest dollars. Put a rock through this window, put a rock on my wife's hand. Put my kids through college. You know, some say Antifa's just an idea, but to me, it's a billion dollar idea. I oh, think that guy's gonna break that? Nah, probably just a window shopper. Do you wanna put this on the Tuesday protest or the yeah, Thursday? Yeah, Tuesday protest. Single pane, too. See, they cheaped out. Yeah, the window repair game's a little like the tow truck game. You know, you wanna be first on the scene. Yeah, and it helps to know where that scene's gonna be if you catch my drift. We usually come a couple hours before the unrest and take these bad boys down. Yeah, we weren't born yesterday, Target. People are cooped up with no stimulus. It's easy to get them riled up. But also, because they're cooped up, they more than ever need windows. windows. Corporate money right there. Big time. Kind of like how the government shut down businesses, forcing you to rely on them. We break windows, forcing you to rely on us. Tensions have died down without the bad man in power, so we've had to work a little harder on the activism side. You know, sometimes when we really want to up the ante, we'll utilize multiple movements. Uh, Ma'am, we're stopping global warming by breaking the windows on 2nd Street tonight. Breaking the system starts with the windows. Racial tension's really good for business. You think you can smash us with a standard hammer, or you think you need a diamond tip? Oh, yeah, we're just gonna meet at 2nd Street, march up to 3rd, and just hit everything on that whole block. Now, we're actually thinking about moving to Portland. There's a lot of money to be made in window repair. Yeah, I read a statistic. 44% of all windows in Portland are currently broken. What are you thinking? Think we can get a rock on the way up there? Pull the right crew together. We're gonna do a number on this bad boy right here. 